Hi friends, happy Thursday. Welcome back to our read aloud for today. We're gonna to continue reading our piggy and elephant stories. And today is a story about getting invited to a party, which you're really, really going to enjoy. So like we've been doing, let's start out with our learning targets so that we know in our brains what we should be thinking about while listening to the story. We're gonna listen and repeat like we did yesterday. Ready? Listen first and then say the words. I can, I can identify, identify the main idea, the main idea of the story, of the story. Very good. And again, that word identify, this big word right here, means that you can look in the book and tell us what it is about what we want to learn from the book. So it's a great one. Let's get started. It's called, I am invited to a party by Mo Willems. Look at Piggy dancing around with an envelope in her hand. Look at all of these envelopes. We see a little picture clue here. It says Piggy on there. So, hmm, I think Piggy's invited to a party. I am invited to a party. Look at her sitting up there in her mailbox. Gerald! Look, look, I am invited to a party. Cool, it is cool. Will you go with me? I have never been to a party. I will go with you. I, kn I know parties. Party, 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 party. Wait, what if it is a fancy party? We must be ready. Really? I know parties. He knows parties. Zip, there he goes running. Zap, there she goes running. And here they come back in their fancy clothes. Look at them ready for a fancy party. Is this fancy? Very fancy. Even when they say the words in a speech bubble, look at that fancy letter writing. Party, 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 party. Look how excited they are in their fancy clothes. <gasps> Wait, what if it is a pool party? Look at Piggy, but we're in fancy clothes here. A fancy pool party? We must be ready. I know parties. He knows parties. Zip, zap. Oh, look at them. Now they're in their fancy clothes with their pool gear. She has her snorkels on and a little float over here. How is this? We will make a splash. Party, 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 party. Look how excited they are. <gasps> Wait, what if it is a costume party? Ooh. A fancy pool costume party? Figgy's like, get a load of this guy. What's he talking about? We must be ready. Zip, zap, he had better know parties. Zap, zip, look at them. Now they're dressed up. 
They have their fancy clothes on and they have their pool gear on. What does it look like Piggy is as her costume? A cowboy possibly? And then it looks like Gerald dressed up as maybe like a magician. Now we can go to the party. Yes, now we are ready. Well, that is a surprise. Here's the party sign with balloons. They're walking in looking a little suspicious, like, hmm, were we ready for this? You do know parties. Look at all of these other characters dressed up just like them in their fancy clothes and costumes and pool gear. Party, 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 party. Looks like they didn't know either. There's even a little mouse down here saying party. And here's our last illustration page. Look at that pigeon popping out of the envelope. I hope you guys enjoyed that story today. So remember what we want to learn from this story is what is it mostly about? Hmm. When I think about that, I think the story is mostly about Piggy getting ready for a party she's invited to and Gerald helping her get ready, right? Think about all the things that they put on. They got ready for a fancy party, a pool party, and a costume party. And when they went to the party, everybody that was there also got ready for that same kind of party. They didn't know either. So hope you enjoyed that story. Take a moment to share those details with somebody close by and we will see you tomorrow for our last read aloud of the week.